Let's talk about Insidious the Red Door. In what feels like the finale to the Insidious franchise, the Lamberts must put this demon away once and for all. Go away, demon. This time Patrick Wilson's not only starring in, but is directing this film. And I have to admit, even though the story was bland at times, I didn't love this script and the movie kind of feels unnecessary. His direction is actually pretty good, and I see some things in there that add a spark to this film, but it tells me he's going to be good in the future. The family's disconnected, but they are the focus of this movie, and we spend a lot of time with Patrick Wilson's character, obviously, but also Dalton, who's older now, he's in college, but he's starting to remember some things that he should not be remembering. There's some creepy shots in there for sure, specifically some things happening in the background, but for the most part, I didn't feel the fear that I was supposed to. <laughs> And while Wilson's direction adds a spark to an otherwise bland experience, the finale feels entirely unnecessary. Certain shots will inject some semblance of fear, but it was never all that scary. That's not what you want in a horror movie.